Hello my beautiful Scorpio, welcome to my channel, welcome back to my channel, Trying Divine Tarot. I'm trying and I will be doing a general reading for you today. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I greatly appreciate that. And don't forget to hit that notification bell, let you know every time I upload a video. Alright, we're going to go ahead and get into this. I'm going to do two coral cards to see what the overall energy is. For Scorpio, please. Okay. And for Scorpio. All right. We have the key. A little message on there is new beginnings, directions, and adventures await for those ready to let go of the past. Okay. So I feel like you have a little surprise waiting for you on the other side of this door. Okay. And we have proposal, a romantic or business opportunity is indicated. So I feel whatever's on the other side of that door it could be a commitment. It could be job advancement. It could be a new location. It could be marriage. <laughs> okay. So let's, let's see. Heavenly Father, Heavenly Angels, what is the key for Scorpio, please? Oh my gosh, here we go. Judgment, okay. So there was a choice or somebody, you're being alerted to something. Okay, you're favored. Okay, so I think this is Archangel Gabriel. He sounds the alarm or he's bringing something to your attention. I know this also is a card that indicates um, calling things back from the dead. Okay, so <laughs> I know in the card it says... New beginnings, directions, and adventures await for those ready to let go of the past. Okay. And maybe there is something from the past that was like getting in the way. Or someone from your past holds this key that would unlock that door. So we'll see. Why is judgment here with the key? Okay. We have the tower moment. Okay, so you're being alerted to something. The tower is a wake up, a shake up, a break up, or a make up. Okay, so <laughs> something very shocking, or this is a big surprise. Clarify the tower. Okay. We have the page of swords. So a message that's coming in might knock your socks off. Okay. <laughs> this is like new information or I don't know if you track down this information or this information just found itself to you. But it's a little shocking. Cleric five proposal, please, for Scorpio. Oh my gosh. Proposal, 10 of pentacles. All right, so. You might be coming into like, this could be a new house. This could be, this could be a lot of money, okay? Or, I mean, the Ten of Pentacles also represents family stability, okay? A legacy, growing old with somebody that you love without a care in the world, okay? Not a financial care in the world. 
that's with clarifying proposal. Okay. This is a marriage. So maybe you heard about somebody's engagement or somebody's marriage and it shocked you or you want to propose to somebody and it's going to shock the world. <laughs> well, let's see. Why is the page of swords here for Scorpio? Oh my gosh, look at <laughs> Things are looking really good for you, Scorpio. I don't know what you're doing, but this is a brand new opportunity. This is the tower, okay? This is the tower that's coming in. It's going to be a good tower for you. It's going to be really, really good news. You found out something, okay? that's making you feel um, happy, joyful, abundant. This is meant for, this is something that's meant for you, okay? <laughs> what is this Ace of Pentacles? It could be a new job opportunity or business opportunity are starting up a business with somebody. I think whatever this union is, I mean, this, this is some a union that takes place, okay? Oh. Um, it's gonna be very like prosperous, like, like you guys are going to build something together and you're going to make a lot of money together. Okay. <laughs> Clarify the key once more, please. I'm feeling like that key unlocks a brand new opportunity, but I think you had to, you had to track down the key holder or something like that. Yeah, you had to track down the key holder. Look at this card, okay? All right. So I believe that these are the eight cups that have been filled and spilled. Lessons learned. And I think you've had enough of, of that. And now you're on to your ninth cup, which is your wish fulfillment. And it could be this opportunity that you have on your mind. And I think you're going for it. You've been guided to go for it. And I think once you obtain this Ace of Pentacles in the long run, it brings you the Ten of Pentacles, okay, if you stick with it. With the moon element here, I just feel like um, that could be that tower, okay? That shocking moment that hasn't revealed itself yet, okay? I think you're still on your journey. I think you're still on your journey to your ninth cup. I think you're tracking down that key that's going to open up that door for you. That's going to open up a new opportunity. An opportunity in business, an opportunity in love. And um, an opportunity in building your legacy. All right, another one for Scorpio. This looks really beautiful. <laughs> I feel like marriage might be heavy on your mind right now, Scorpio. It might be something that you're thinking about. You might be at that point in, in your life where, where that energy matters, okay? And you, you really want that for yourself. Okay, another one for Scorpio, please. Oh, look at this beautiful card. Okay, it is the star. Okay. So I feel like you're sending out your signal. 
and you're putting it out there and you're hoping that your divine counterpart see what is that called um the bat signal okay i'm feeling like very bat signal about this or your person is calling you to them but i think you found your person and they're all that you've been hoping for and wishing for and you can really see a future with this person okay The star is the, the energy of hope. So I'm feeling like two star seeds come together and they create something out of this world, okay? <laughs> All right, one more for Scoprio, then I'm going to put a love card on it, okay? One more for Scorpio, please. All right. The magician is here. This is what you're manifesting. Okay. You're manifesting a brand new beginning for yourself. An abundant. You have everything that it takes to advance, to create the life that you want. Okay. You had to release some burdens. You had to leave that energy where it was and move forward. That might have been a little difficult for you, depending on your situation. But I feel like you're totally invested in your future. And you're doing all the right things and making all the right moves, okay? And if having a family is in your next conquest, okay, I think that... It's going to be everything that you've been hoping and you've been wishing for, okay? All right, super beautiful. Let me, I'm gonna get one of these love cards. These cards are like self-love cards and then they're like community love cards. But let's see what comes up for Scorpio, okay? For Scorpio, please. Okay, evolution. This is kind of what I'm feeling too. The evolution of the Scorpio, okay? This is this is the, the story, the Eight of Cups here for the Scorpio, okay? The evolution. We're evolving to our ninth cup. Let's read the message. You realize that obstacles are merely lessons on your path to love. I think that sums up this whole reading, okay? So I'm going to leave it there. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. I would greatly appreciate that. And also don't forget <clears throat> to hit that notification bell. It lets you know every time I upload a video. All right, Scorpio, that's looking real good. Till next time, baby dolls. Ciao.